It's just about 5.30. Thanks for coming back for the news now. I'm Colin Mayfield. And I'm Vanessa Rufus. Just days after winning the Republican nomination for North Carolina Governor, Lieutenant Governor Mark Robinson is facing backlash. This after a 2020 video resurfaced on YouTube. And people ask, what's the full story behind the video? WCNC Charlotte's Megan Bragg gets the facts in this Verify Fact Check. So Robinson is well known for making some controversial comments during an event hosted by the Republican women of Pitt County. Robinson, who was running for lieutenant governor at the time, is caught on camera saying he would absolutely want to go back to the America where women couldn't vote. But it's important to know the context behind this quote. So let's get the facts. We watch the YouTube video ourselves. I absolutely want to go back to the America where women couldn't vote. But that little snippet, which has now gone viral, needs a lot of context. In the 2020 video, Robinson made reference to a previous question that was posed to conservative political commentator Candace Owens. Owens was asked, and this is a quote, which America would you want to go back to? One where women couldn't vote or one where black people were swinging from trees? Robinson then asks himself the same question, and he says he would pick the situation in which women couldn't vote. He explains by saying America was better than because Republicans fought for real social change. WCNC Charlotte has reached out to Robinson's campaign to ask about this video, but we have not heard back. So while Robinson did say he wanted to go back to an America where women couldn't vote, that quote itself is taken out of context in the stories circulating around social media. Robinson was using it to make a point about the Republican Party supporting women's suffrage. Here is the rest of what he said. Because in those days, we we had people who fought for real social change and they were called Republicans and they are the reason why women can vote today. So while yes, Robinson holds views that have been criticized as being insensitive and intolerant, in this case, the claim that he supports going back to a time where women couldn't vote isn't exactly what he said. With your Verify Fact Check, I'm Megan Bragg.